guys, what's up crazy Puerto Rican here today to review Dragon Ball Super Episode 7 and uh, to summarize this episode, everyone got their asses kicked. <laughs> yeah, everyone literally got their asses kicked. I mean, Gotenks transformed and Goten and Trunks, sorry, transformed into Gotenks and uh, he, he gets his ass kicked, Piccolo gets his ass kicked, uh, freaking... 18 gets her ass kicked and a funny part was when uh, Chi Chi goes to Krillin and says oh why aren't you with your wife why aren't you fighting and it's like because I gotta protect Marin and oh my god Yamcha stop thinking you're strong you're not strong Yamcha's like oh I'm gonna protect your daughter with my life I'm like dude Majin Buu just got his ass kicked by this guy you can't just protect her like that. I mean, what are you going to do? Go super earthling? <laughs> I mean, come on. You, you know Yamcha's not going to do anything. And him, in the last episode, he's like, oh, I'm the strongest guy on earth. I'm like, really? Like, dude, really? You're the strongest on earth? Krillin is stronger than you, dude. So, yeah. Anyway, so, Vegeta, he goes, he, he fights because he, he says, like, well, there's no other choice. I'm gonna have to fight. And he gets his ass kicked. And uh, this is probably one of my favorite parts in the episode when uh, Beerus is already gonna finish him off with a key attack. And uh, he is, he's like, well, at least I'll be, ki I'll be killed by a god. It's an honor, really. And then... That right there, I was like, whoa, awesome, that's that's really great. Uh, then Bulma comes in, boom, bitch slapped uh, Beerus. And Beerus was like, did, did, did you just do that? Did, did she just do that? And Vegeta knew, was like, wait, Beerus, what are you going to do? Vegeta knew that uh, Beerus was up to something, and uh, he hit Bulma. <laughs> yeah, but when he hit Bulma, my god, Freaking Vegeta got pissed. He was like, my Bulma? You hit my Bulma? And not in the way, like in Battle of Gods. This time, he was literally pissed. It looked like he was going to go Super Saiyan 3. Please make that happen. Please, 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 toy. Super Saiyan 3 Vegeta, please. Pretty please. I'm, I'm, uh, I'm just saying, I mean, it, it could help a lot of fanboys. I uh, mean, uh, yeah, anyways. So... Yeah, Vegeta, he's pissed. He's gonna get... He, he looks like he's gonna go Super Saiyan 3, but seriously, if when you look at Vegeta, you're like, oh, damn. Th 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 it, it was like, you, you would think that Vegeta's gonna kill Beerus now. And you, you would be like, at, it was at that moment, Beerus knew he fucked up. Because if, if, if I didn't know what was going to happen already, I would be like, oh shit, Vegeta's going to kick Beerus' ass. But I know what's going to happen. Uh, Vegeta's going to get his ass kicked. Goku's going to save the day. Yay! Now, don't get me wrong. I love Goku saving the day. But give the spotlight to Vegeta for a change. I mean, you have the ch I hope that in... The Resurrection F arc, they gave they give him a spotlight because there was something in the movie that I did not like with Vegeta, which you should know what I'm talking about. I'm not trying to spoil anything, but three, two, one, spoiler, Vegeta lost his spotlight because he was about to kill Frieza. All fanboys were going to get what we wanted, but he didn't. So I really hope that Vegeta does kill Frieza in the Resurrection F arc. But anyways, back to the episode. This episode was really good, really good animation. I really did enjoy the animation. Not like in that episode 5 crap that we got. I'm sorry, but episode 5 was just crap. Come on. We, we know that. We, we, we DBZ fans know that. Well, anyways, pretty good. The next episode preview shows Goku sh like he showed up. And, of course, we're not getting Super Saiyan 3 Vegeta, which I really, really wanted to see. But in the next episode preview, Goku shows up, and it looks like he's ready to kick ass. So, let's see what happens. Let's see what happens with Vegeta. Let's, Because I want to see him fight. I want to see Vegeta 
take get some punches into Beerus, even if it's not Super Saiyan 3. And even better, I want to see it in a better form that in that in Battle of Gods. I want to see it like, holy shit, that actually just happened. So, yeah, overall, pretty good episode. I just gotta say, amazing. And Yamcha stopped trying to be, try to act tough, because Yamcha is not tough at all, and we know that. Uh, I do understand Krillin has to take care of Marin, but dude, can at least fight a little bit. Help everyone. Uh, and yeah and I mean it's okay to take care of your child because even though you're gonna die either way if that happened but you know Krillin fighting with the hair like that would be amazing to see and yeah I just really can't wait and also where is Champa I'm sorry for the spoiler but where's Champa in the manga he would have appeared already in the second chapter but I don't know he was supposed to appear by now I do hope that toy is smart and uh, saving him up f to appear at another episode that's better because this one was mostly centered on you know Beerus Vegeta and all that so let's see what happens anyways this enjoyable episode Go watch it if you haven't. DBZ fans will really enjoy it. And honestly, I just want to see Vegeta getting some punches in Beerus. So, yeah. Leave your comments below. Remember to subscribe. Later, guys.